Hello friends, uh, I'm Sam Jalwala from Acropolis Institute of Technology, Indore. Now, I'm going to take a big short review, give you a short review on Microsoft Expression Web 2. It will be the previous version of Microsoft Front Page and Microsoft Expression Web, which is to be two years ago. Now, let's have a look on what Microsoft Expression Web does. Now, as we can see, there is a main panel that's a dashboard that you can see. The left, right, and five panels on it. The first is the page, the main page. Now, here we can design a web page of what we are desired to. So it's very easy. Uh, it's a three views. First, it's a code view where we can just put our place of code of HTML codes and CSS codes, whatever we wish to. It's easy editing. And then at the design mode, where we can just put our layout or designs like pictures, text box, where we want to place it, and we can just visualize and make your website very easy. Now, other is split. The split mode gives you a functionality like your. We can type, give you an example like "Hello, boy." So now we can just have a preview or uh, below it. In a split view, just you have to type a code or vice versa, or we can just give it type in the design mode and get the code on code. Now, on the right side of the expression web, we have got two panels like folder list and tag properties, by which, by which we can easily access what our files and folders of the website project, what we are making of, and tag tag design, tag attributes, where we can decide our tag attributes and its CSS properties uh, very easily. Now, let's come to the right side of uh, Expression Web 2. There is Apply Styles, and uh, we can make new web style CSS style sheet. And we can also manage our style sheet of the website. Like, we already generally we know that it's very difficult to make a website or design, so we can just give you a CSS style sheet over it. And here comes the main feature of Expression Web. It's the toolbox. Now, the toolbox gives you many main tools like tags, form controls, and media. We can also just put flash, put out flash media, silver light -like media, or Windows Media Player directly through a web page, just drag and drop, and here we have, it's a media. Now, another thing is that it supports ASP.NET controls and AJAX also, so which 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 is very easy for make, making website, like we have got standard uh, AJAX, standard.NET tools like text box, check box, images, so we can just put it on and it also supports Visual Studio 2008. It also supports Visual Studio 2008. So we can just put our code from Visual Studio to Microsoft Expression Web. And it's an AJAX support which is very useful in current websites. So it, it, it supports HTML 4.0. Now, there are other features which we can talk about. So here was this little review of Microsoft Expression Web 2. So get marching and let our Microsoft make much better tools for this. Here was a short review by Hussein Jawaharlal.